Yeah, something. <laughs> That's actually good for me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> uh, this has been really, really great. And I hate to cut it short, but I'm meeting a friend for drinks in an hour, so. Oh, you know, no worries. I completely understand. Sunday fun day, right? <laughs> and plus, none of this was planned for. So, and yes, I had a great time. Um, maybe we can do this again sometime? <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> awesome. Well, I don't want to keep you, so um, can I get your number and then maybe I'll just text you? Wait, what? Oh my God, how'd you, how did you do that? Wait, technology. <laughs> awesome. I look forward to doing this again. Yeah, me too. You're a good hugger. <laughs> Bye, buddy. Bye, bud. Yeah, I'll see you later. Come on, bud. Come on. Come on, bud. We gotta go. I think he likes me. <laughs> that makes two of us. Come yeah. on, go. go. Come on, bud. <laughs> Let's go. Oh Lord, Jordan. Um, what do you mean? <sighs> She's such a child. We just had this conversation. Um, you seriously were just talking about how you needed time after Meg. Elsie, you won't believe who I'm getting lunch with. Damn it, Jake. I know, shocking. Well, that's a bummer. I mean, obviously the date didn't go well, but that doesn't explain why you're so tired. What'd you do after the date? Really? I stopped drinking after dinner and I drove myself home. When I got home, however, I proceeded down a few bourbon vodka. Mm hmm. Yep, I know, Dad. I just don't understand why there is a problem. And I doubt you ever will. Listen, I have to get going. Okay, but this is not going to go away, so you're going to have to come to terms with it. Mm hmm. Love you. The f Perfect timing.
Again? Fuck my life. Listen, I'm having dinner with her. I'm not moving in with her. Plus, I waited a few days before I asked. Are you convincing yourself or me? Oh, shut up. Fancy? What? Is it fancy? Because I know you, Jordan, and you move too quickly, and then you get burned. Ish. It's fancy-ish, not fancy-fancy. It's got good food, okay? God. Are you silently judging me? You are, aren't you? Fine. I promise I won't order any expensive wine, but I cannot promise you I won't order the creme brulee. Fine. Fine. Love you. <laughs> Just asshole. Hi there. Hi, buonasera. Welcome to La Marea. Do you have a reservation this evening? I do. Jordan Solar? Uh, yes, party of two. So uh, your guest has already arrived. So if you follow oh. me, please. Great. Thank you. Starting without me, I see. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Sorry. It's that kind of a day. It's quite all right. I like a woman who knows what she wants. Oh wow, this is nice. Yeah, I mean, why not, right? Why not? Cheers. Cheers. How's the wine, ladies? Really delicious. delicious. Excellent. Yeah. Would you like to hear the specials? I would love to hear the specials. Yes, yes please. <laughs> Well, for an appetizer. <laughs> it was seriously the most embarrassing thing ever. <laughs> it's hilariously <laughs> embarrassing. I mean, I think you got me beat. Oh, I cannot top that. I don't think anyone can. <laughs> hey, you all right? Jordan. You okay? Hey, you all right? Um, yeah, I, sorry, I need to go to the bathroom. Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay. Sir, what, what the fuck? Oh my god. S seriously, Sarah, what the actual fuck? Who the hell is this? Who the hell is this? Who the hell are you? And what the fuck are you doing with my girlfriend? Girlfriend? No one said anything about having a girlfriend. Oh no? Uh That's interesting. Um. <coughs> Sorry, dude. I'm just gonna... You clearly have a type. So is that what you've been doing while I've been in LA then? It isn't like that. Oh, no? So what is it like then? I didn't even think you'd be home. That's your response. I've been home for a week and I find you on my couch making out with a random stranger and that's your response? 
get out. You know, things have been really different. I save it for someone who cares, Sarah. Get out. Kelsey. Get out. You're right. Looks like you saw a ghost. Funny you say that, um, because I thought I did. When I moved out here from LA, the girl I was seeing ghosted me. Really? I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, I thought I could handle it, you know? Um, at first, I thought something happened to her. And, um, and then I doubted myself, which it's so not like me. And then anger and a whole mess of feelings that just overwhelmed me. And I, I thought I was over it, but I seriously just thought I saw her. That sucks. I'm really sorry. <sighs> it's okay. I'm just glad you were here when I got back. Look, we've all got our stuff. I'm, I was genuinely concerned about you, and it really did look like you'd seen a ghost. Plus, I'm not the chew and screw type, and I like to get at least a glass or two of wine in to ensure it's worth my time. I like that. So, tell me more about yourself. You really want to know? Yes, I do. Okay. No worries. I had things I needed to get done, too. Maybe we can meet up at the end of this week. Oh my god. Okay, have a good night and I'll talk to you later. So, you finally meet the elusive Brian? So, you finally meet the elusive Brian? No, he needed to work. He's having issues with his mom and apparently he needs 2K by the end of the month. What? It's not like the third time this month he's cancelled on you. Do he ask you for money? What? No. Are you sure this Brian is who he says he is? Of course, we've been talking for a month. And he's a gay man and you haven't met up yet. And he keeps on cancelling on you, and now he's talking about needing money. Seems dodgy to me. Mm-hmm. Oh, please. Jake, for real? Have you gone mental? Have you FaceTimed? No? Talked to him on the phone? Seen an updated post on social media, hmm? No? Those are some facts right there. Jake, I don't want to say anything about this, but I have a bad feeling about this whole thing. Mm. He's probably some 50-year-old wanker who, like, lives in his mum's basement with a bad collection of porn. Mmm. Mmm. Like that 1970s grainy shit? Oh my god, you're such a drama queen! Yes. I don't even know who she is. If he asks you for money next, don't say we didn't warn you. Mm. You better listen to us or he's headed for a world of hurt. <clears throat> Can you shut the door? Yeah, mom. Okay. 
I will. Uh -huh. Okay. Bye. Things like your family does. Other packs. They're dangerous. How do you know? Dad would have wanted you. Homework. Why, hello there. Hi there. How are you this morning? Hi, Dean. I'm fine. What's up? Well, I talked to your dad last night, and he said to call you. Of course he did. Are you available tonight to go to dinner? Listen, Dean. I'm not sure what my dad told you, but I'm not interested. Currently. But you don't know me well enough. Really? I'm not at all interested. I see. Well, I'll try my best to make you interested. Pick you up at six? Dean, I'm not available tonight. I have to stay in and get work done. I understand. Well, I hope you have a good day and I'll see you soon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you too. Okay. <sighs> All I wanted to do was ride the wave of a good date and boom, wipe out. Fucking dad! Fucking arranged marriage crap. Fuck. Hey. Um. What are you doing here? I needed to see you. Uh. Well, I'm glad you're still doing whatever the hell you want. Been ignoring you for a reason, Sarah. We seriously need to talk. We do? About what? Well, everything would be nice. Yeah. Well, it's a little late for that, don't you think? Come on, Kelsey, every... Every time I try to talk to you, you do this. <laughs> you shut down. Can we just talk? Please. Um... I'm not sure there's anything I want to say. I don't want to know the... the why, the how, the when, anything. I'm so sorry I hurt you. Yeah, sorry's not gonna be enough. Not this time. Hi. 
Hi, how was your day? Good. Yours? Okay. You hungry? Well, currently thirsty, but uh, I will be. What's up? My place. Seven o'clock Thai food? Yeah, that sounds perfect. I'll bring the wine. Even better. See you at seven. Okay. Seven it is. See you soon. Well, that's a nice way to end a work week. <laughs> end a twist job. Mm -hmm. Fix this floor. Oh my god. Elsie! Cece! Yes, Jake? Look. Ugh. He spelled laid wrong. Come on. He spelled laid wrong. Ugh. I mean, out of all the words. Poor fellow. <laughs> okay, I'm just having a bit of fun. You know what he's gonna ask you next, right? Yes. I am such an ass. Oh, no, you're like blindly trustworthy like a little puppy. Oh yeah, that's a good one. Like a puppy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's adorable. <laughs> Usually. Mm. You know what I really want to know? Who is that guy in the picture? Mm -hmm. Brian? Oh no, he lives. He's hot. <laughs> I feel so violated. There it is. I am so stupid. Mm. Yeah. Mm. It's okay, honey. You know, it could be worse. You could have been a serial killer and used your skin for a handbag. Just saying. I couldn't decide. Oh boy. <laughs> you pick. No pressure. None. <laughs> How about white, since we're having Thai? Does that work? Yeah, sure. Looks good. It's nice to have you. Thank you. This is such a nice surprise. So how was your week? It was good. Good, I mean, long, but, you know. How was... How I hope you don't mind. But I already ordered a few things. It's a Friday night and I just didn't want to wait. No, that's great. We had a conversation about Thai food, didn't we? We did. Oh, good. Less to worry about. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. So, how was your week? It was, uh, it was, it was interesting. Uh, but I've decided it's the weekend now and I'm just gonna leave it behind me. Oh, I'm, I'm so sorry. I did not. That was quick. It's fine. What the? Everything okay? Are you, are you doing something? Who is it? How are you? I'm okay. Jake, you don't need to be so hard on yourself, okay? I know. I've just been reading a lot about people who've been catfished, and the majority of them just say it's because they're lonely. Ugh, it's so depressing. Okay, Alice, well, that is a rabbit hole you need to avoid. Too late. Come on. What? Get your ass up, okay? Enough of this sorry for yourself bullshit. Fine. Okay, now go get dressed, okay? We're going out to breakfast. Uh, okay. Oh my gosh, enough of this self-pity, Jake. It's not attractive, okay? You sad sack of sorry. Sorry, McSorryton. Okay, enough. Oh, I'm sorry. Doesn't gay mean happy? Where's Elsie? Worry about yourself, Jake, okay? That's your, that's your problem. Mm, mm hmm right, 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 right. Mm. Can you hurry up? Mm-hmm. Oh, look, Florida's calling. No, mm, Hello? Yes? 
Yeah, this is Jake. Hey. What? Uh, so from your text earlier, I could tell everything was not okay, but certainly nothing a little bibimbap and ice cream can't fix, right? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay. You are a god. I know. Yeah. I know, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh. You are me. Okay, yeah, yeah, cool, cool. Yeah, I'll be right there. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. CC, I got the job. Finally, someone wants me. Yes. Evening, ladies. I'm here to see if Amber is ready for her date. Date? Date? What are you talking about? What, your father didn't tell you? Clearly. Hi, I'm Dean. I'm uh, Amber's suitor. Uh, what's going on here? Seriously, what are you doing here? I, you know, I gotta go. You don't need to go. Uh, Dean, Dean is leaving. It's a pleasure to meet you. Yeah, no, I gotta, I gotta go. I got some stuff I gotta take care of, like figure out my fucking life. Jordan, please don't go. Dean, you want the Thai food? food? I love Thai. Jordan, let me explain. Maybe another time, but not now. That's, that's just uncomfortable. Jordan, I didn't leave when you freaked out in the restaurant. Like I said, we all have our shit. Yeah, that's because I was freaking out about something I thought I saw. That, that I totally saw. And it's just a little too real for me right now. Have a good night. Oh, I have a food order for Amber. Yeah, that's, that's me, thanks. Smells delicious. Yeah, yeah, delicious. Dean. You have to talk to me about things like this. Really? Oh, stupid life is crap. Morning. Morning. Is that a box of sugary flaky pastries? Gluten free. Fine. If there's anything else, I'd say no. Thank you. Can I get you a cup of coffee? Sure. So sorry, I left like that the other day just it was all just so overwhelming totally understandable i get it i just wish you had stayed i ended up kicking dean out and uh you really should have seen him <laughs> plus i got way too much thai food is there such a thing <laughs> you have a point <laughs> Good morning. Knowing you, you never left the couch, so I hope the blanket helped. Don't worry about anything today. Just wake up slowly, get breakfast from your favorite place, and do something good for yourself. OX, Hassan. Easier said than done, Hassan. You know, I just, my dad just doesn't wanna accept the fact that I'm queer, and he just keeps trying to set me up. 
Really? So interesting. Yeah, it's awful. And there's Dean, who's just clueless. He thinks if we spend enough time together, I'm just gonna change my mind. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah. So sorry I fled. It's not like me at all. I've just, ever since the Meg thing, I've been doubting everything. I feel like I'm losing my mind. <laughs> I totally get it. I mean, it's different, but I totally get it. I think we should just put this whole thing behind us and go get breakfast. Good, because I'm famished. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Really, Hassan? Why did you even text me if you were just gonna show up? What are you doing here? Hey. Hmm. I'm not leaving until we talk. Listen, <laughs> now that we've got all that out there, we're just going to leave it in the past. Mm -hmm. We're going to move forward. Sounds good to me. Okay, great. And no more surprises. I've had enough <laughs> surprises. You and me both. Okay, perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Meg. Meg? What are you doing here? Now this... This is awkward. So much for no surprises.